everyone it's Jen here the diamond painting gamer a very very warm welcome to my channel um, if you saw uh, my last paint gem unboxing video you will know that I got uh, four kits they were doing a special offer of buy three get one free and uh, I have already unboxed the uh, doors edition and the birds edition so what I will do is I'll link that video for you so that you can uh, have a look at it if you haven't uh, watched it already. Anyway, this is part two of the same order and we have the Safari edition, which is quite an old uh, edition. It's been around for quite a little while. And we also have the geometric edition, which is one of their newer ones. So uh, let us get into it. Let's look at the Safari Edition. Let's look at those, all those lovely, lovely animals. So uh, the, all the kits come in a nice sturdy cardboard box. There is a cardboard sleeve and on the back of the sleeve details the designs that are inside. So if you don't know all your Safari animals, <laughs> we've got them listed on the back. Okay. So inside the box, um, every uh, kit comes with a toolkit. So we will have a look at it on this box. The toolkits come in these soft canvas bags. Don't think there's anything left in here. Nope, that's it. Um, we have in our toolkits, we have a small white boat. Uh, I like to keep a hold of these. Um, I use them for when I work on paintings with a lot of confetti. And we have some plastic tweezers. They're sharp, they're not too bad quality. We have a diamond painting pen, clear one with a comfort grip. We have a couple of um, multi-placers, a 10 placer, which is super funny given the fact that they're mini kits and a three placer. And they are the wider ones, okay? So they're not the narrow ones, they're the wider ones. And last but not least, we get a caddy of heart-shaped wax. Um, I do like the paint gem wax, it's, it's really good. It's nice and thick and dark. Um, I tend to use these waxes as it comes with the kit. Um, most of the time, not all the time, but most of the time I use these kits when I'm out and about. I take them with me when I'm going on holiday or for weekends away. I've normally got a box of them in at my work. Um, I sit and do bits and pieces at lunchtime um, when I'm in work. So, so yeah, <laughs> uh, I keep everything in these boxes, which is, you know, they're really good, contains everything. And I just use the kit, comes with it. Easy for portability. Um, the drills, well, it's Safari Animals. We're going to have quite a limited colour palette. A uh, lot of neutral colours there. Um, I can see a little bit of red and green, I think. Um, uh, but in lots of greys, browns, tans, creams, uh, black. <clears throat> it's kind of what I've expected for, for this um, type of kit. Uh, the drills all come individually bagged. They are squares and they are resin. So um, it's these wee mini kits are great if you want to try squares for the first time and you're a little bit apprehensive. You can um, have a go on one and you can either love it or if it's not quite you, you can gift the rest to um, someone else. So you can share them out amongst your friends because, um, yeah, lots of little canvases. Right, I should have a sticker sheet. Ah, here it is. Every kit also comes with a sticker sheet. Um, the paint gems are the only ones that I don't kit up. I work straight out of the bags. Um, as I said, I tend to take these out and about with me. So uh, it's everything's all self-contained in this cardboard box. Um, it takes up less space. Um, so, for example, here we go on this bag here, it's uh, number 27 and it's 310. And then your sticker has got the DMC number on it, 310, and that matches up with Symbol X. So just take your sticker off of your sticker sheet and stick it on your bag and you're ready to go. That's as much kitten up as you need to do. Well, you can do more if you want, you can put it into little pots, but 
you don't really need to if you don't want to. Let's have a look at the animals because that's what we're here for. We're here for the animals. It's got a bit dull, the sun's kind of gone away a little bit, so um let me see, let me see if I can put the light on. We might get a bit of a glare, so hold on. Three, two, one. There we go. That might be a little better. I can certainly see better anyway. So let's have a look at our Safari Edition. Okay, so we have a panda. And we have a camel. It's really good, that one. It's got a lot of detail in it. We have a zebra. A giraffe. A hippo. A lemur. Look at those eyes. Oh, that's a warthog. Is that a warthog? Let's have a look. What's it saying here on my sheet? Oh, it says buffalo. I thought that was like a wee piggy leggy, like a warthog or something. It's actually a buffalo. There we go, eh? <laughs> Didn't think they looked as quite as thin in the face as that. Oh, what's this? That's a hyena. An elephant. I know that one. Oh, fennec fox. Look at those ears. A gorilla. Tiger. Well, that's where most of the colourful ones are going to go, I think. Isn't he beautiful? Very majestic. I can't go over how much detail um, you get in these little minis. I mean, look, look at the detail on that tiger's face. It's amazing. And a lion, a koala, uh, this is an ibex, and we have a rhino. So we've got animals from a multitude of continents. We've got Africa, we've got uh, the Americas, uh, we've got Asia, we've got uh, Australia, uh, is there any that I could call European? Mm, don't know. Don't know. Probably not, actually. <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> right. Okay. These are really cool, these safari animals. I like them a lot. I've been eyeing them up for a little while. So... Let us put this all back together in the box. Um, we will put our drills. Let's get our toolkit away. I think I've saved the best one to last, which is the geometric. And this is the one, this is one of the new ones. And as soon as I saw it, I was like, wow, I really need to have this. It, um, you know I, I love uh, mandalas. I've, I've done the mandala set from, from Paint Gem. Um, and this kind of like is a kind of natural progression from the mandala. So we have 12 different geometric designs. There's some black and white ones as well as some coloured ones. They're going to look quite striking, I think. Okay, so we have her toolkit again. I'm not going to bother opening it. It will be identical to the last one. We have our bag of drills. Lots of white and lots of black. So, yeah, there's, from what I can see from this box, one, two, three black and white designs. So, yeah, we have a lot of that. But we've also got lots of um, beautiful colours there as well. So basically, we've got the whole rainbow going on. Um, we have our sticker sheet, not a diverse number of colours, but it's big bags of um, lots of different types of colour. Blue, yellow, orange, green, purple, red, teal, yeah, as well as black and white. Let's look at these designs. Can't wait. Okay. 
Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to give these designs a measure. I think they're all pretty much the same size. <clears throat> Let's measure the uh, drill area. So the drill area on these designs are seven and a half by 10 centimeters. Very patchwork looking, aren't they? They look very much like patchwork, some of them. Okay, so that's our first design. Whoa, that's funky. I like that. Very colourful, this one. Now, I do single place all my paint gems. And I was thinking, I might well go in and multi-place this. But no, because I like to take my time over them. Um, even though there's these geometric designs lend themselves to multi-place. And I think I will still go in and with my single placer and single place them all. Here's the first black and white one. This is cool. Another blocks of colour. This looks like it's woven. Um, this looks like a woven pattern. That looks really, really cool. Another geometric uh, black and white one. Some blues. Oh, that's very 3D looking. Look at that. That looks like this, the middle of the shape. It's just going down and this is like the edge and they're going down into pits. I like that. Here goes another one, very colourful. Oh, this looks like a series of cubes. Oh yeah, love these. And we have another one that looks a bit like a maze, black and white. And we have some diamonds. And then we have these triangles. Wow. Oh, this um, this is definitely right up my alley. I, I really, really, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to love doing those. I really, really am. Okay, let's pop them away. Um, what do you think? What do you think of these uh, very, very, two very, very different types of kits? The geometric shapes and then the safari animals. So um, I bought these, as I said, um, in a four pack. Um, they're, I don't think they're doing that anymore. Uh, I will link the website. Uh, they do now offer free shipping to the UK again. Um, if you spend over a certain amount, I can't remember what that is off the top of my head. Um, now, I am a Paint Gem affiliate. Uh, if you have, um, you know, if you like any of these uh, kits that you have seen today, or if you fancy going onto their website and checking them out and having a browse through some of their other products, uh, if you see something that you like, please feel free to use my uh, code, which I will link down below. Um, you will get, I think it's about 10% off your order. I'll get a little bit back as well. And um, and yeah, uh, yeah, the win-win for everybody. Who doesn't like a wee bit of money off? Might even be 20% off your order now I'm thinking about it. I'm not entirely sure. Um, I'll go and look it up, I think. But yeah, um, please check out Paint Gem. I love them. I really, really do. I'm addicted to these little mini kits, um, as you're probably more than aware by now. Um, if you fancy going shopping on the website, don't forget to use my affiliate link down below. Save yourself a little bit of money. And uh, yeah, I shall see you uh, in the next video, which um, once again, I think is going to be another Paint Gem one, but it's it's going to be paint gem with a little bit of a difference. Yeah. Because I've started doing other things as well as diamond paintings. There we go. There's a teaser. Anyway, uh, that is it from me for, for today. Um, please leave a thumbs up. Please leave a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. And I shall see you in the next one. Okay, guys. Cheerio.